Hello there, this is Roberto Matthews. A few of you have asked me how I make my uh, fertilizer, my liquid fertilizer by the gallon. Uh, this is a really nice way that I do it and an inexpensive way. I like doing it this way because um, I feel that since it's dry fertilizer um, mixed with water instead of already pre-mixed, I save a couple of bucks and it lasts a lot longer. So these are the uh, three ingredients that I use, uh, if you don't count the water as an ingredient. Um, I use Epsom salts, so magnesium sulfate. I use calcium nitrate, and I use um, the master blend. Now these two are easy to find at your local garden center, um, probably even a uh, big box st store. Um, and you could probably even get it cheaper than this. I got for $7, I got four pound bags and then I ordered online master blend uh, four pounds uh, that's all I felt like I needed and uh, I have it double bagged here because I wanted to make sure that it was sealed um, when when I opened the original bag which did not have a seal um, so that's the only thing so when you do receive it if you order it online not all the time do you get a resealable bag so I would highly suggest to put it in a two gallon um, Ziploc bag, one gallon for the inside and one gallon for the outside, okay? So uh, to make the one gallon version of this, uh, instead of a five gallon version, which is what you normally see, um, you get yourself from Amazon or from any other place similar to Amazon, um, get yourself a little gram uh, scale Make sure it's accurate. It doesn't have to be one hundredth, or in other words, 0 .00 accuracy. It could just be one tenth or 0 .0 accuracy, um, because uh, you just want it to be enough to where, as you add these fine grains, that it will go up. Okay. So the formula I use, and all I did was I divided the grams that takes for five gallons by five, and I got one gallon. So it's two grams of the master blend. 2 grams of the calcium nitrate and 1 gram of Epsom salt and that's that's really it so you just go ahead now what I'm, I'm using here is uh, one of the covers for my um, my arrow garden it's one of the little covers to, to as a bowl and that way as a matter of fact you can see how accurate it is it says 1.3 uh, grams for just that so obviously you press tear and you go ahead and you uh, add so a couple of other tools I have is a, a little uh, measuring cup and I'm not really measuring using this, I'm just using it to slowly put my grains in here. And then of course a little funnel with your, uh, to put everything together. And then you add water. So I'm going to go ahead and put two grams of the, uh, of the master blend and two grams of the calcium nitrate. So before I continue, I wanted to show you something cool that I noticed about this scale. This is the AWS 1kg, 1 kilogram scale um, from Amazon. And uh, what I noticed is that there's a little dot there that as, the, as it finds accuracy, it disappears. And as soon as it settles on a, on a weight, then it appears. So it's a little extra visual representation that it's actually found its uh, accuracy. And here's one gram of, of the uh, Epsom salt going into the gallon. And then all I do is go ahead and turn this off. All I do now is um, put some water in here and the water will agitate this and I'll be right back and I'll show you the beautiful color that I get. Okay, so here I am back. It looks like there's nothing there, but um, when you first start adding water, it'll be green and then it'll be lighter and lighter and lighter green. And there is my one gallon of uh, fertilizer. And as I said before, um, I use this mainly for my, um, for my hydroponic, or not hydroponic, but yeah, hydroponic, but for my crack key um, 
lettuce and for my crap key basil. And as soon as I run out of the fertilizer for my arrow garden, this is what I refresh the water with instead of regular water. And it seems to work beautifully with the uh, arrow garden and it's uh, not as messy as the residue that you get from the Aero Garden fertilizer. So uh, if you have any questions, just let me know. Have a beautiful day and thank you very much.